How we doing? Welcome to Sam Goff and Guitar again, where we talk all things guitar, pedals, and lessons especially. Um, check out what we're looking at today. We're looking at this beauty, which we've kind of looked at before, but we're also looking at this one. Now the reason I'm talking about both of these, because I just wanted to highlight a couple of amazing UK pedal builders. These are basically one-man operations. They're really small teams. Uh, literally, it's one guy building these things and then selling them on. So, Reeves, Electro. These have been getting a lot of press anyway lately because of uh, the pedal show. That pedal show kind of taking uh, a number of their pedals. And, uh, yeah, they, they're they really, really, really good. Lots of fuzz-style pedals. This one's a red dot sound. They've got a black hat. they got a few others. Uh, really worth checking out up at the website in description so you can check out their website. They are not cheap, but they are incredible. So have a look at the internals here. As you can see, just top-notch qualities. The workmanship is amazing, bringing art to the internal aspect of a pedal. What a thing to do. And the other one is Elephant Pedals. Elephant Pedals, find them on Reverb. Again, UK-based. Pretty sure it's just one guy. And as you can see from the insides, again, top-notch quality, top-notch build construction. These are yet to really go mental. So you can get a really nice one of these for 100, 150 quid. The Reeves, you're talking 250, 350, 450 for some of their ped pedals. Uh, yeah, so they're, they're going up and up and up and up in prices, demand increases. So get there soon if you want some. Right. Let's have a little listen to them. Let's start with the elephant pedals. This is a one knob fuzz, silicon, and uh, it does what you expect. It is a beast. Oh! One knob, <laughs> it's got one sound. It just gets more and more nasty. <laughs> right, let's just roll back on this volume a little bit. <laughs> Oh, it's beautiful, beautiful. And then anyone that loves silicon fuzz is gonna probably wanna hear it with a bit of octave on it, right? I certainly would, so.
thing is, <laughs> it's just mental. It's such a beast. It's like my amp's going to explode. It's just amazing. Um, but if you add a bit of reverb and a bit of delay, though, which I'll do in the DAW, it just really can give you some really, really nice lead lines. Brings us to the Reeves Electro Red Dot Sound. As I said, full demo of this up already, so check out that if you want more details on it. But let's have a quick playthrough just so you can get an idea of how amazing this thing is. Right, now, watch the way it responds to the volume knob on the guitar, right? amazing it cleans up beautifully And then goes to that it's just awesome um yeah open the bias up boost the level so you know here it closes off there um and then gets really really spitty if you want it to be like quite buzzsaw you know Amazing, right? And then open it back up. It's noisy, right? But a lot going on. It's a strat, single coils. Chuck some octave on there. can mess around it all day, it's such an awesome pedal. Uh, and again, can give you some lovely lead tones. I will just mess around with it a little bit and I stick some reverb and stuff on it as well so you can just hear it with a bit of processing because it sounds great.
anyway there you go two uk pedal builders you should be aware of in my opinion attention to detail of the pedals the components used absolutely top notch and therefore the sounds and the response of the pedals also top notch obviously these are two very different pedals both fuzz but very different so i'm not trying to compare them in sounds hopefully you can hear and tell how enthused i am by them and you can hear just how good they are at what they both do what are your favorite pedal builders are there any out there that you think people should be more aware of post in the comments let's have a look let's check them all out all right take care let's look after the little man let's look after the small businesses trying to make way in this world all right i'll see you soon take care